Hello friends, welcome back to the Domain Racer. And today's topic is most interesting topic and it is the most requested by the users. So in this video, we are going to compare WordPress versus PHP. So let's start the journey of difference between or comparison of WordPress versus PHP. PHP is a server-side programming language and it helps you to create a dynamic interactive pages. And when we talk about the basic understanding about a PHP, PHP act like a link between web pages and a database. And similarly, WordPress is also built with the help of PHP. So you can able to say that WordPress is built with a PHP means PHP is the base of WordPress. So still, why we are comparing PHP versus WordPress? There are a lot of reasons, a lot of things that we have to consider because if you are developing a website with the help of PHP and same website if you develop with the WordPress, you will get a lot of differences. So to reveal this all the differences, we are going to create this video. And if you want to know what is the difference between web developer versus WordPress developer, the link is given in the description. You can be able to go and watch that video. So let's do a more understanding about WordPress and PHP. Whenever the user requests for the page in the WordPress, so that time WordPress will communicate with a PHP. In this case, the backend PHP preprocessor compiles the data and it will generate a HTML code for the user and will deliver it. So in simple words, WordPress uses the backend as a PHP and store the data in the database and it will deliver to the user and the final result that is a web page is delivered to the user. When we compare both WordPress versus PHP, both have its own advantages and disadvantages. Please make sure that this video we are going to create for those who do not have a deep knowledge about a PHP because if you have a very good knowledge and you are going to build your career in a PHP. So in this case, this video might give you only few advantages for the PHP. Here, we are not going to target this video to a hardcore PHP or a web developer because web developer jobs are very critical and they are doing a high level of AI based operations and they are developing automations with the help of programming language. So in this case, you must need to go with a core programming language. So those who are like PHP, Node.js, AngularJS, React.js, there are a lot of programming language. They, they might be a server side or a client side. So you can able to go with all this programming language and build your own AI based application. But here we are focusing on easiness and effective that helps you to build your website. So based on this, we are comparing PHP versus WordPress. Once you start using or learning about a PHP by default it includes a WordPress because WordPress is already built with a PHP. If you wanted to do any customizations in the code or you wanted to develop any applications which is already been available with the help of WordPress it means you do not need to create with the PHP again. So just need to go and use that functionality with the help of WordPress and in this case you will save your prestigious time and efforts. The functions like if you are going to create a website and you wanted to create a website in that you wanted to continuously change the code. Let's say an example, you wanted to create a website or portfolio. In this, you are continuously updating the data, you are updating the images, you are updating the content, you are updating the theme or a design or look. In this case, whenever you are doing all those things, you can able to do that with the help of WordPress and same you can able to do with the PHP as well. But the difference is if you go with a PHP, you have to learn all those things and this might take a lot of time and energy. Better we have to shift with WordPress. Why? Because with the help of WordPress, you can able to easily build your website by just drag and drop operations. And even if you do not have a programming knowledge, you can able to build a very awesome website with the help of WordPress. Why WordPress has been introduced? To make this world more simpler and the enterprises like domain racer and any other companies that wanted to go online they can able to do very easily with the help of wordpress they just need to install a wordpress and do the customization there are plenty of themes and plugins are available over the internet we are not here 
giving advantages and disadvantage of WordPress. So if you wanted to know be specifically about anything about WordPress, the link is given in the description. In that link, we had already covered what are the advantages and disadvantage or why we should have to choose the WordPress is already covered in that particular video. But here we are talking about a PHP right and WordPress. So both we have to compare very properly. So we will move forward for a point to point or a six major points based on that you can able to take a very good decision whether you have to go with WordPress or a PHP. Very first whenever we are talking about online that time security is the one of the major concern that we have to follow and in this case if you are building your website with a PHP or a WordPress so in the both cases the WordPress is already have a predefined all the scripts and all and with the help of that you can able to secure your WordPress very easily. In simple words, we can able to give a higher scoring to the WordPress for the security. And when we talk about the PHP, in this case, you need to learn a lot of things. You must have a, at least four to five years of experience to get a huge understanding about the securities and avoiding any cold level patching. So basically, we can able to very well secure your WordPress. If you wanted to know how to secure your WordPress, the link also given in the description. So you can able to just watch that video and secure your WordPress. You do not have to learn anything in the programming and the core level. You just need to go and follow the simple steps and your WordPress will get secured. If you wanted to create our websites like LMS, Learning Management System, so you can able to create very easily. And Domain Dresser is now already launched that platform, so you can able to create your online coach courses and you can able to launch a lot of things. So in this case, let's try to understand what you can able to build with WordPress and PHP. So the very first, if you are going to create any websites, so that like example, portfolio, e-commerce website or education management system, CMS. So for the example, you are going to create a landing page. You are going to create an e-commerce website. You are going to create a school management system or you are going to create an online portal for examination or you are going to create an online learning miss. So user will come and learn more about the courses and all you can able to sell online. That also can be possible with the help of WordPress. But the same thing you can able to do with the help of PHP as well. But the thing is, if you can able to go with the WordPress, so that time you just have to go and search for that plugin or theme and you have to install it. And th this entire process will take hardly one or two hours. But when you build or you can able to write a PHP code, that time you might able to need at least one year or two years time to create a fully functional system for your website. So better to focus on automations or already existing open source applications in the market. And WordPress is one of the best application, you can say CMS. So that helps you to create a different, different and various websites for your businesses. So there will be a huge variety, but there will be also limitations in that. And when we talk about the PHP, so which application we will prefer to go with the PHP because if you are going to create a portfolio website so in this case you have to write everything in a PHP so it is not necessary to write in a WordPress just drag and drop and your website will be ready right so in this case same thing in the PHP some applications like AI based application that needs a human interface. So, so that needs a human interaction and create a very awesome system that is not exist in the market. So that time we need to go with a core PHP based concept. Similarly, if you are doing a daily automations or you are doing a automation for the businesses. So that time you have to go with a PHP and the most of APIs and interconnections between the applications or the websites can be handled with the help of core PHP that cannot be helped that cannot be built with the help of WordPress. So basically this is what the difference is between PHP versus WordPress. Now we will move towards the second point flexibility WordPress is have a huge community. So you can able to say like if you build a one floor of your building, you will build a second floor of building. So that time you do not have to recreate first floor and second floor, right? The so similar concept happens with the WordPress. Once you create an e-commerce plugin or e-commerce theme, 
you do not have to worry you just have to use that plugin and you are ready to go so similarly when we talk about a php it has to create each and every time new things and you cannot able to find the resources available on the internet so you can able to get the surety that you will get a better code or better security kind of things from the internet but it is available in the wordpress there are millions of themes and millions of plugins available that means it's a huge range of applications already built you just have to pick it and customize it and you are ready to go that is the biggest advantage of wordpress so you can able to say when we talk about a flexibility wordpress will get a highest score because here if you are not a programmer so in this case definitely wordpress helps you to build your website very functional even if you can able to create a appointment management system learning management system and lot of things with the help of wordpress now after all those things we have to know which one out of them is a cost effective so in this case if you are using wordpress or a php both are open source but php needs a lot of coding and all so definitely you need a expertized or experienced person for that and the payment or you can say a payout to the person is very high and if you are building a single learning management system or e-commerce based application let's say let me give you an example on this let's say you are going to create a learning management system in this case if you are building with the help of php you might need a 8 months or 10 months to complete your learning management system but with the help of wordpress you can able to do very easily just you need to add the plugin the plugin actually the plugin will cost you a small amount like 100 dollars but same thing if you are building with a php so that time here you might need to pay 5000 to 7000 dollars to completely build an application so this is what the biggest advantage of wordpress when it is already available in the market just go and pick that code so in this case the good news is domain racer is already offering lms hosting at a fraction of cost so if you are going in the market it will cost you at least 300 dollars per year but we are giving at a very lowest price and if you wanted to know more about that you can able to just go to the our domain register and contact our support team they will help you out and if you wanted to know more about the videos and how it works the video guides is already given in the description and you will get a lot of learnings and our goal is to helps you to learn the things so you can able to grow so we definitely go together now only few points are left now it's the fourth point google ranking so whenever we are talking about the google ranking so we need to know at least 200 ranking factors right so this means you need to learn all those ranking factors and implement in the code so that is a very hectic job but in the wordpress it is available with the help of plugin just you need to add that plugin and you are ready to go so this is what the biggest advantage here also the point will go to the wordpress okay here is the announcement domain racer offering a premium seo tool to our all customers so definitely you will get the advantage of it if you are a customer of domain racer so if you wanted to know how this tool work you can able to just go in the description of this video the video guide is already given in a very brief format so you can able to understand what value you will get with the help of seo tool for your business this is what we are trying to add the value to our customers if you have any query you can able to comment below and the sixth point is productivity and updates so wordpress it itself is a huge community the people are consistently working to improve the qualities and improve the automations in the wordpress so you do not have to worry about all these things but when we talk about a php everything you has to do yourself if you want to do upgrade your system you have to do a manually coding and all there are a lot of headache will be there now we are in the 21st century and here you do not have to worry about updates as well because wordpress has a capacity to update himself means automatically he will update with a latest technology or a latest programming codes so you do not have to worry about outdating of your wordpress so because it's automatically get updated but in the case of php and all you need to do manually things all the factors and we have also created one more video about detailed comparison between wordpress developers versus web developers so you must have to watch that video as well so this is what the thing we are trying to explain in this video if you have any queries or you want any solutions 
please comment below we are available 24 by 7 and we will like to help you out so basically for now subscribe our youtube channel and like this video so we will get a more energy for creating similar content